What up, y'all? We back with another one. And today, we got the Dr. Guts Art Primo Mops. Just came in the mail a few days ago. So, we're gonna see how good they are. Yeah. These are the ones that GR was talking about in his video. Saying that uh, the people that made the formula had made the silver pigment too thick. And uh, didn't want to go through the mop nib. So, they end up putting the metal head nib. That's a pretty good idea. If you've seen these metal head video of the creep that I did and you know that these were pretty much right on anything so the fact that they put them on here to solve that problem is pretty smart uh, it does they said it had a ball bearing in here that was too big and will clog the nib so we're gonna get that out of there uh, report it back in uh, replace it and then we'll be good so yeah let's see let's see if it's cool So, the first thing I did when I put these out of the box was I pulled the cap off. And I can already tell you, just from that first time pulling the cap off, that these R Primo metal head nibs are already have one up on the crank. The crank nibs are too loose. They come off too easy. They don't stay on good. Uh, this, you hear that? That shit is on there. Look at this one too. That's good. The crank nib. Look at the crank. Comes off like nothing. Oh, maybe this one is messed up. No. Okay. Look, this one too. It's too loose. This is the same size nib. Yeah. It's just their cap is no good. Which, that's important because if you have one of these without the stopper in here, if you don't have this stopper in here, and you got this lid that's loose, this is not a, this is not really airtight. That would dry out your paint, dry out your ink. You'll waste all this shit. And the way crank is charging for these mops, man, no fucking way are you gonna let that shit happen. So you just gonna have to keep that stopper or what? No, just make a better lid, and you'd be fine. Crank, and stop charging fucking too much for your shit. Yeah. So let's see.
are pretty good. The Art Primo Drip Mop is a good medium sized mop body. It's a squeezable body if you want drips. The Dr. Guts formula paint that they got in here is thin enough, but it's highly reflective and highly permanent. Now that they put the metal head on top of here, I think that this is one of the best metallic industrial markers that I've ever used. Overall, I do recommend this. Thanks for watching. See you next time.